everybody. Good evening. Th Thank you so, so much for being here. Like Anand said, we are extremely humble that you have all made it from around the world to come to our home. Thank you so, so much again from me, Anand, and both our families. When Anand and I decided to get married, the one place we wanted to celebrate was Jamnagar, really within our hearts. The hard work of our families and the dedication that Neeta Auntie has to making all of our dreams a reality has made this possible. We have been extremely, extremely indulged. I, I have seen all the events with all of you for the first time today. I had no idea what was going to happen. I was so surprised when I walked in. People are asking me, is that normal? I said, it's normal if you have a mother-in-law like Neeta Auntie. So, <laughs> Thank you so, so much for doing this for us and letting us enjoy the process of our wedding. Anand. <laughs> Anand and I are so, so lucky to have some of the most amazing women on this earth as our influences. Neeta Auntie, who will move heaven and earth for her children. Isha, who is our most fierce protector. Shloka. You are the kindest person, and I would be completely lost without you. Anjali, you are the force behind anything good that I have in me. Mama, you are our safe place. You've taught us how to be our most authentic selves, and you've taught us to find a silver cloud behind any gray... Uh, you've taught us to find a silver lining behind any gray cloud, and thank you so much for that. The men in our family are special too. I didn't forget about you guys. Papa, you are the most encouraging man I know. You have built the confidence of the three women around you with the utmost love and care. The example you have set as a father and a husband has shaped my life in so many ways. You will never know. My brothers, Anand, Aku, and Aman, you bring so much laughter into our lives. You are our true kings of comedy. But at the same time, you are our most dependable allies. I love you three so much. And Mukesh Ankar, you have been a father figure in my life from very early on in our relationship. And I truly hope for everybody that they have a champion for their relationship like you have been a champion for ours. For Anant and me, Jamnagar is where our heart is. This is where we grew up, where we became friends, where we fell in love, and where we built our relationship. Now, as we begin our future together, we will be doing it here, and we are so thankful that you get to see the beginning of it. This place has become part of our fondest memories, our deepest secrets, our loudest laughs, and the happiest times that we've had together as a family. It's seen us go through all our ups and downs. In March of 2020, Anant and I got locked down here and we couldn't go back to see our family for months. Although it was hard to stay away, we learned to appreciate the small joys of life. But in Jamnagar and with Anant, the small joys are once in a lifetime experiences. One day, we got a call saying one of our rescued elephants was giving birth. Since she was brought up in captivity, she was extremely stressed by the process. I watched as Anand stood there with her Mabath through an eight-hour labor process, patting her down through it and ta calmly talking to her. Now we have a beautiful baby, Hanuman, who is almost four years old and as naughty as ever. People ask me, when did Anand start Vantara? I don't think there's any start date. It's always just been in his heart. He has been able to formalize this institution more and more over the years. I've had the privilege of watching Anant and his team pour their hearts and souls into making this vision a reality. Anant, I will never be able to express how proud I am of you. Someone once told me, what do you really find when you find a partner? What you really find is somebody to witness your life. There are over a billion people on this earth, and what does one life really mean? 
But when you find somebody, you find somebody to promise you to care about everything. The good, the bad, the beautiful, the bold, the sad, the mundane. You say, I will see you every day. Your life will not go unnoticed because I will notice it. Your life will not go unwitnessed because I will witness it. And Anand, I'm so blessed to be a witness to your beautiful life. Anand and I are so lucky to be able to share this place so close to our heart with you all. Jamnagar is not just an example of how expansive Indian industry can be, it's an example of how expansive a human heart can be. Anand's grandfather, Sri Dhirubhai Ambani, dreamt of opening the world's largest township here, the world's largest refinery here. Mukesh uncle executed this dream with precision, and Neeta and he built a vibrant township where, and a green belt where, which was, on which was once barren land. This gave Anand the world's greatest canvas to fulfill his passions. Three generations of our family have worked together and dedicated themselves to Jamnagar, and we feel so humbled to be able to share it with you all today. Thank you once again for being a part of our celebrations. I hope that the grace and the beauty and the magic of Vandara touches your hearts like it has ours. <laughs>